Hi guys, a few months back I made a video on unboxing the Nighthawk Custom Warhawk Airsoft Blowback Pistol. If you haven't watched it already, you can check that on my channel. Now, a couple of weeks later with a couple of games with that 1911 Custom Airsoft Pistol, I want to give you some feedback, what I like and what I don't like. This is not long term review, this is my first impression on the pistol itself, on the replica, for the just a few games that I have with it. I made a few games with that replica and I already have some good and some bad impressions out of it and I wanted to share it with you. We'll start with the good news. This pistol shoots fantastically. Out of the box, without any adjustment on the hop-up, I was able to perfectly nail 0.3 grams of BBs. Perfectly straight, without touching the hop-up which is fantastic. It has a really nice kick and the gas efficiency is just enough to finish your magazine, which is pretty tiny. However, it holds 25-26 BBs and with a single fuel, you will not have any issues to finish the BBs in the magazine. However, if you go in a burst mode or push it too hard or the weather is a little bit more colder than usual, then maybe the gas will finish a little bit earlier than expected. And of course, the pistol feels really well really fantastic, the kick is really nice out of it and has amazing sound. Unfortunately, there are some bad things that I want to mention here. The first negative I have on this pistol is the paint job. You can see literally for 2-3 games, the paint is already coming out of it. You can see it here, you can see it on the edges, this one also, and the most surprising part is that part of the grip right here, the only contact to that surface is my hand. Literally, just because of my hand, the paint is coming out right here. I just imagine after 20-30 more games, it will be really bad. The second negative about this pistol is I had some issues with the beaver tail in the beginning. It just didn't seem to work pretty well. It wasn't a big deal until that point, which is currently right now which literally it does not shoot at all. It cannot release the hammer. It just feels like the beaver tail doesn't release the trigger at all. No, no matter what I do, even if I go without the magazine, the result is the same. So, I'm not sure, maybe it's something really simple that I need to fix. However, I wanted to show you just before I disassemble the gun and check what's inside. I hope it's not something serious, just because I really love that pistol, it's fantastic, it shoots really great and would be perfect sidearm, but we'll see that later. This is what I wanted to share, shoot fantastic, great hop up, feels really well, however the paint job is not great, even it's on the worst side and I have that issue with the trigger and currently cannot shoot at all with it. So stay tuned, I will give an update once I figure out what's the issue with the hammer. Thank you for watching and have a great day.